Uh, an enterprising um, council approach is very much a, a bold approach. It's uh, an entirely new one uh, for us here in Derbyshire. We've been delivering services in a very traditional way for a, uh, for a long time. And I think there's a real need um, to, to re-look at how we deliver services as a, as a county council and really sort of challenge um, uh, uh, sort of service delivery models, if you like, and get best value for money. We're going to look at entirely across um, all of the services and, um, and it's going to be about embracing new technologies. It's going to be about using uh, the technology we have much more effectively and efficiently. And um, it's also going to be looking at how we uh, uh, deliver contracts and how we uh, procure um, contracts within the, uh, the, the organisation as well. You'll know that we've got uh, very significant budget challenges um, as an organisation. And um, over the next five years, we've got to find just over £63 million. That's not an insignificant sum. So we've got to challenge um, every facet of the way we deliver services as an organisation. The enterprising council um, approach allows us to do this. Uh, what we hope this will um, help us to achieve is not just achieving the £63 million um, saving, um, but also delivering real sort of benefits for the taxpayer as well in the sense of uh, we are hoping to do a two-year freeze, for example, um, of council tax. And that's important to us, not just as an administration, but as a council, because we realise that um, taxpayers uh, are the ones that ultimately carry the can for the delivery of the services as a council. And the enterprising council approach is very much not um, wedded to any sort of uh, particular philosophy about privatisation or anything like that. What it is very much about is looking across um, all of our services. And if we find we are delivering a service that is effective and efficient in-house, we will continue to do that. Of course, there will be instances when we look at services and it is very clear that in some form of externalised model is the way that that will work better and that's what we will explore. The community really does have um, a role to play in uh, delivering the enterprising council agenda and um, uh, the, re the reasons for this are really very clear. We can't do a lot of what we do without the help from uh, um, the community and that's going to be more particularly the case in the, uh, in the future. Um, a good example of this at the moment is we're exploring uh, community managed libraries. It's imperative that we have that buy-in um, from the community to look at how um, those libraries will be managed in the future. The Enterprising Council approach is going to be um, extremely important to uh, um, the delivery of services in the future in uh, Derbyshire. And it's going to be the key driver, the, the key engine, if you like, for change within the organisation. And that change is all about one particular thing, and that is getting uh, best value for the taxpayer's pound in Derbyshire and delivering high-quality services.